Hello and welcome to Record Wreckers. My name is Dani. And I'm Luca. And this is a show where people try to wreck the world records and tell us all about their strange talents. Indeed they do. Today's guests, Jed and Lucas, are eager to begin. So let's start the show. Hi again, I'm here with Jed, our first guest. He's an artist who claims to be the fastest caricaturist in the world. Hi Jed. Hi. What do you do for a living and where are you from? Well, I'm from Bedford, Jordani, and I, I'm a cartoonist and caricaturist, simple as that. Oh, and is that full time? And that's full time, freelance 35 years. Yes, nice. Um, how did you get into drawing caricatures? Well, strangely, uh, as a cartoonist, I was asked to do somebody famous in a live situation did that and I thought, hey, I can do caricatures yeah. and it's become a way of life for 30 years. Oh, nice. Okay. And if you could pick anyone in the whole world to draw, who would it be? Anyone in the whole world? Oh, my goodness. Uh, I'd probably want to draw the most beautiful woman in the world. And as you're sitting there, <laughs> oh, let's get on with it. Stop it. <laughs> do you think you could get the fastest record um, for the fastest caricature? I don't see why not. I've had a lot of practice. Oh, yes, you have. Right. It's time for Jed to get ready. Let's learn a little bit more about drawing caricatures. Caricature is a painting or more usually a drawing um, of a person, usually their face, and it focuses on special features of the face in order to uh, mock that person. Um, the first caricatures we used um, early, like in 1600s, even Leonardo da Vinci, very famous artist um, has used caricatures in his um, artwork. They can be used and displayed in galleries, in magazines, in newspapers, um, and it's uh, widely used around the world and still very popular today, uh, especially when talking about famous uh, political figures or famous people. Hello again. Everything's set up and it's time for Jed to attempt the world record. Tell me, Jed, are you feeling ready? I was born ready. Well then it's time to begin. You're going to draw me, as a caricature, in the fastest time possible. You're on. Ready. Ready. Steady. Yep. Go. Okay. Let's get this hair down here first of all. All right. Tell me my nose is too big. Uh, in your dreams, pal. Right on. Nice. Okay, nice bit of forehead that goes in there to start with. Uh -huh. Nice. And yes, there's the nose. Let's look another look at you. That's great. And how's that? All righty. Well, let's have a look at what you've got for us. Okay, let's just strip it from the old easel here. Exciting times. And uh, <laughs> that is that is great work. Well, uh, the results are in though. Time to beat was 48 seconds. Okay. Jed, you did it in. Drum roll, please. 31 seconds. That means you've wrecked the world record. Oh, yes. Congratulations. I'm, um, uh, may I? Of course you can. Hang so, on to this. I do enjoy it in good health. I'm going to treasure this and stick it on my wall when I'm back home. But for now, back to Danny for our next guest. Thanks, Jed, and thanks, Luca. Our next guest is Lucas. He's going to attempt to beat the world record for folding the most T-shirts in one minute. Welcome to Record Records, Lucas. Thank you for having me. <laughs> no problem. Where are you from and what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm from St Albans and I study at the University of Hertfordshire. Okay. You know. And um, so do you do a lot of laundry at home? I do my fair share of laundry. Yeah. I find it quite soothing, quite oh. like it, yeah. Okay, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> what made you want to try this challenge? Well, I've always wanted to try something new. Uh, I tried sports and it doesn't agree with me. And I thought, well, what do I have and what do I like a lot? And I thought, T-shirts, let's fold some T-shirts. Oh, that so, is true. You yeah. all have a lot. Of t I'm wearing one right now. <laughs> exactly that. Um, do you think you could beat the current record for 23 T-shirts in a minute? I'm certain I can give it a try. Oh, yes, yeah. confident. I like it. Well, we'll see how you get on very soon. But first, let's see how well the public did when they took on this challenge. I'm out in the field, pounding the pavement, to see if we can bring the challenge to you guys. Today, folding t-shirts. 
Go! Oh no! <laughs> My mum should really teach me how to do this. Three, two, one. Oh! Right, so sadly, uh, none of our public participants managed to beat the challenge. Hopefully, they'll have a little more luck in the studio. Alrighty, we have everything set up for our second challenge. In front of us, we've got a load of t-shirts for you to fold. And uh, I think that's all we're going to need for this challenge. Tell me though, are you feeling ready, Lucas? I think superbly ready. Excellent. You've got a minute on the clock right. to fold as many t-shirts as you possibly can. Ready. I'm ready. Steady. I'm, I'm steady. Go. Alrighty. Solid start. A few on the clock. Hey, you're racing through. That technique is polished to a mirror machine. Coming up in 20 seconds now. Uh, third of the way through, nearly a half, but golly, that's a world record setting pace if I've ever seen one. Coming up on 30 seconds, halfway through. Ah, you got this. I'm feeling this one. This is going to be one hell of a folding run. All right, nearly done now, friend. That's gonna be 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. Ooh. Ah, that's a lot of t-shirts. Very exciting stuff, yeah, but did you. you fold enough to beat the previous record at 23? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 t-shirts. Good, but not quite enough. Oh, I'm afraid man. you didn't manage to wreck the previous Thank record, you. but Thank you so much for taking part in our show. It's been a pleasure to have you on. It's been a pleasure being here, thank you. Righto, now let's go back to Danny. Sadly, that's all we have time for this week on Record Records, but we hope you'll join us again soon. Indeed, next week, we're going to be attempting the world record for the longest distance traveled on horseback while juggling fire. Thanks for watching, good, good night. night.